This is a video about our Grex Nepenthes Titan's Mirror. That's a hybrid of Nepenthes Truncata and Nepenthes Mira. Uh, we selected 10 clones to keep from this cross. Uh, we don't expect too much variation in this hybrid. Primary hybrids tend to be fairly uh, similar compared to complex hybrids. Um, and what variation shows up when they're young often smooths out as they get older. But we uh, selected 10 of the strongest clones from the uh, first set, uh, just in case any of them showed particular promise. Uh, as you can see on the uh, leaf shape, the truncate leaves of the truncata seem to have come through pretty well. Um, the plants on the left, over here, were grown in our warm room after they were selected, and over here they're grown in the cool room. So you can see that uh, this cross probably prefers slightly warmer temperatures, um, but uh, it does just fine in, uh, in a standard highland setup as well. Uh, I imagine this will be a pretty easy uh, intermediate grower. So if you look at the, uh, the plants up close, uh, you can see that they're holding a fair amount of pitchers, and uh, they're just beginning to show some really nice color from the Nepenthes Mira, uh, mostly on the undersides of the pitchers. This is probably our biggest clone uh, that we've selected so far, um, and it's showing really nice red color. Or, there you go. So you can see, I uh, expect as these grow out, that'll become pretty uniform across the pitcher. Um, just to zoom in on some of them. Uh, a few of them seem to be a bit uh, stockier in pitcher shape. Others are a little bit longer with more of a, a, a banana-like shape. But again, that will probably come out in the wash as they get older. Um, and we'll keep an eye out for anything exceptional that pops out. But for the most part, uh, they're just looking pretty nice. Um, there's, uh, they're coming out of winter, and so we expect them to put on a lot of growth. You can see this one right here has a massive leaf jump. Uh, on the newest leaf, and uh, that that is the tail end of winter actually, so the next one should probably be very large. These plants are almost two years old. I believe they'll be two years old in July. It's uh, just the beginning of May now, so we've got a few months before they're two years old. Uh, these are in two inch band pots. They're looking pretty nice. So we expect this cross to continue growing nicely. Um, we're looking forward to seeing more of this reddish, uh, reddish orange color come out. Um, and we are also hoping that it gets pretty big because the seed parent uh, right here is just a monstrous Nepenthes truncata. So this is the plant that we call Titan. Um, this is its winter pitcher. So that's a nice small pitcher that it made during winter. Uh, as you can see, <laughs> It's bringing a lot of vigor to the table, so this will probably be a pretty solid cross um, once it's all developed. I can't really get a full picture of Titan. Uh, but there you have it. There's uh, Titan on the left, and uh, down here is Nepenthes Titan's Mirror.